Today I've got a video, I'm going to take you over to my computer screen and I'm going to show you exactly how I trade a strategy for Forex. It's a nice little short term strategy, trades last less than 24 hours, so it's like a day trade strategy without having to be at the screen watching the prices. It's fairly, it's fairly automated. I set up the trades in the evening, it takes me about 10 minutes. I trade about between six and seven major Forex pairs using this strategy. It's like a daily breakout, so it's catching the move during the day, whether it's up or down, we can make money both ways. It's quite active. For each Forex pair, it trades between 30 and 40 trades per year. So if you're trading, I recommend you trade more than one pair for a bit of diversification. I trade, like I say, at the moment, seven pairs. So I'm looking at well over 200 trades per year. So it's nice and simple, using no fancy indicators or technical studies. So we'll go over there now and have a look and show you exactly how it's done. Enjoy. Okay, we've got the chart in front of us. This is a chart of the British pound versus the dollar. It's quite a recent chart. And I really randomly picked this chart just because there's four decent examples of our daily breakout type strategy. So what we're looking for is inside days. So inside days, that means that the high and the low of the day we're looking at is within the range of the high and the low of the previous day. So look at the first example. This, this bar here, this 23rd of April, this is an inside day because the high of the day is here. The low of the day is there. And that is within the range of the previous day. Okay, so that's what we call an inside day. They're the days we're looking at for our little daily breakout strategy. So when I see one of these days, what I do is I'll place two orders. I'll place a buy stop order and a sell stop order to sell short. So I normally place them about three ticks above the high and three ticks below the low. So on this day, um, we, we look for the high. We want to place a, a buy stop order ever so slightly above. So if during the next day, the momentum starts to go upwards, it will trigger us in, get us in long on the trade. Exactly the same with a short sell. If during the day the momentum started to trade downwards, we would get in and we'd short sell this. It's exactly the opposite. Uh, the, the stop loss on the trade is always the opposite end of the daily bar. So if the buy stop enter is at the top, the, the um, stop loss is down at the bottom. And exactly the same for the short sell. So on this trade, you can see that the next day, uh, the market went up and we got in long and it was actually, that's a really good trade. And the exit on these trades is literally is to, is to manually close out at the closing price of the day. So here, it would have been the right at the top of the day. So we look for another example. There is a few on this chart. Here's the next one. So again, 20th of May, we can see the high and the low is well within the high and the low of the previous day. So that's what we call an inside day. That's what works with this daily breakout strategy. So again, we place a buy stop order just above the high of this day with a stop loss at the low and exactly the opposite with a sell stop to short sell just below the low with our stop loss at the high of the day. So this day we can see again, momentum in the market started to go up. It filled us, got us in the trade long, and then we manually closed out at the close for a decent profit. Look for any more inside days. Here's the next one. Again, another profitable day. We would have got in long just above this high and sold out manually here for a little profit. Here's another inside day. And again, we would have got in long on this one and sold out manually for a profit at the close. Now when I say the close, what I do is 
because it's 24 hour markets, because FX, Forex, foreign exchange, they the markets don't shut only at the weekends. So it's a 24 hour market. So actually within my charting package, the, the charts produce these daily bars um, from, I, I'm never up this late, but I believe it's midnight to midnight. But what I do is, because I'm not, I don't want to be trading at midnight, I look at the charts around 10 o'clock, 10, between 10 and 11, whatever's convenient for me in the evening, which is, it was between 5 and 6 p.m. New York time. And what happens there is, although the markets are still open, the volume really dries up and the prices tend to not have any big moves. They just kind of go sideways for for a few hours until the daily uh, the big daily volume comes in the next day so that works it works fine with me okay so that's a little example of this daily breakout strategy you can use i use this been using it for a while and i i tend to use it just on some of the major forex pairs i use about seven six or seven okay so there you go that's a little day trading strategy that I use without sitting by the screen all day. It's very active. You're going to churn out little bits of profit week in, week out. At the end of the year, it's going to add up to quite a nice, sizable chunk. You're not going to catch major, major moves because, it's, because trades only last 24 hours. It's like any day trading strategy. But it's something to add to your portfolio of strategies it's not the only strategy i trade i trade it alongside others but it's a nice basic one to get you started okay so look out for the next videos i'll show you modifications on that strategy i'll show you extra strategies different ones and um yeah get you started or if you are started already get you even more profitable okay so any questions, email me at thetransparenttrader.com and subscribe to my YouTube channel and check out my blog. Okay, thanks.